Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Ain't We Got Fun. I hope you're all doing good. I wanted to share some things I bought at Dollar Tree. Not a lot of stuff, but it was from a few days ago. So let's get started. Today is Tuesday night. I'm trying to be quiet because folks are trying to sleep. So hope you guys are able to hear me okay. Sorry if it's not too clear on whatever device you are watching this on. And first thing here, something I'm constantly buying from there. I know that you can get a better deal on this at some grocery stores or Walmart, but when I'm there, I just want to go ahead and get it and not make extra stops. It's these fold top sandwich bags. They're made in the USA and you get 100 bags. Next is this pill holder. This one is quite big, so it's probably for folks who have quite a few pills or some big ones. And they have the days of the week represented by letters and spelled out. Some of these latex gloves just for cleaning. You get 10. And one size fits all multi-purpose. This Reach toothbrush in soft. And it's made in China. And I wanted to try this Enamel Guard toothpaste. Enamel Guard Extreme. It says compared to Sensodyne Pro Enamel, you get 2.7 ounces. And it's made in the USA. I like these so much, I bought a couple more for backups. It's the Suave Professionals Replenishing Body Lotion with Dead Sea Minerals. You get 10 ounces, and these are made in the USA. I couldn't find an expiration date, but I'm assuming they last a while because of preservatives. Next is this Lady Liberty Hazelnut Spread with Breadsticks. You get two of these little cups. Um, they're 1.5 ounces each, and they are made in the USA. And I'm planning on giving these both to my nephews as treats. They'll let me know if it's not so good. They're not too picky, so if something is bad to them, it's probably pretty bad. But I won't be able to give you as accurate of a review and, I guess, my personal tastes. But I'm hoping they're good. I like hazelnut spread. One box of these Nips Chocolate Parfait. You get four ounces, no artificial flavors or colors. And I read, I checked this already, it is made in the USA. And it's gluten free. One of these tool bench decorative duct tapes, uh, this one looks like dandelions. And that's made in China. One of these Benzac Acne Solution Skin Balancing Foaming Cleanser with Calming and Soothing East Indian Sandalwood. You get 6 fluid ounces and 0.5% salicylic acid and that's made in the USA. And this is going to expire in October. I'm okay with using stuff like this for a while longer. I figure with chemicals it's it's probably going to be good for a while after it expires and i saw in the news recently that expiration dates are usually a guideline and a lot of things are good for a while longer yes depends on what it is and one of these crest just the regular toothpaste i switch between toothpastes this is, has 2.9 ounces i wish that i had bought more when they had the bigger tubes but i didn't and crest this one is made in Mexico. And this, I have already gone through maybe three or four of these pure and natural rosemary and mint shampoos. Sometimes I see the conditioner, sometimes not. The conditioner works fine for me, but I like how this gets pretty soapy. It's hypoallergenic and paraben free. It's made in the USA. You get eight fluid ounces. You might not like this if you have dry hair um, because it gets so soapy, but it is great maybe during times when you've been working out or your scalp is oily. It really just makes it feel clean. 
And last thing here is something I haven't seen yet. It's the Cultural Advanced Immune Defense Immune Support Formula. You get 10 capsules. And it says, fast-acting ingredients supports upper respiratory health. And this is made in the USA. So I haven't really used anything like this before, but I think it's just a blend of vitamins and probiotics that are supposed to help support the health of your immunity. So I guess maybe the ability to fight off disease. Things like this do tend to take a while to take effect. I probably should have bought a couple of these to get a better idea if I notice any difference, but that's okay. I might pick up some more if I see it again, just because I have seen commercials for this brand. And I will show some cards that I bought. I already gave them to my mom. She needed a birthday and a retirement card, and I found a couple of what looked like really good ones in the 50 cent section. So I'll show you what those look like on the front and the inside. And sorry, I had to be quiet in this video and it might have been a bit shaky but thank you all so much for watching and subscribing and liking my videos i really appreciate it and i'll talk to you guys again soon